Six incumbent lawmakers have been ousted this primary season, and Alaska Senator Lisa Murkowski could be next. The votes are still being counted, but Tea Party candidate Joe Miller holds a slight edge over the longtime the GOP senator. In Arizona, the voting is over, and Senator John McCain has won big. The former GOP presidential candidate survived the toughest primary challenge of his career from conservative J.D. Hayworth. We've had a good night. Now let's go back to work, fight as hard as we can through to November, and get our country back. Both McCain and Miller had the backing of Sarah Palin. Sarah Palin has magic. Looks like five of the races that, that she was involved in, she won all of them. Control of both houses of Congress will be up for grabs in November, and with primary season winding down, the focus is shifting to the midterm elections. That I will be the next senator from this state. Florida Democrat Kendrick Meek wasted no time looking ahead after winning his primary battle. If he beats Republican Marco Rubio and independent Charlie Crist, he'll be the first black senator in Florida history. Analysts say Meek and anyone else running this November has to find a way to attract moderates and convince voters they've got a plan to help jumpstart the struggling economy. Joel Brown, CBS News, Washington.